All right, what's going on you guys? Today we are back here on BJ Customs to teach you another how-to. And today's how-to is gonna be how to customize your own bait pattern, bait hats, bait shoes, bait whatever. This bait pattern will get you there. To create a hat or something like this with that bait esque pattern, what you're gonna need is to be able to print out some paper, print out that bait pattern. You're gonna need to have a smartphone, I hope you're watching on a smartphone, to access the pattern to look at it. You're gonna need some paint, you're gonna need some pencils, you're gonna need some paper. But specifically, you're gonna need Angelus Direct Paint. You're gonna need a couple different colors, black, greens, oranges, maybe, who knows what you're gonna need. So you wanna be prepared with some Angelus, some paint brushes, some towels, stuff like that. Towards the end of the video, I should have a materials list of what you guys need and what I use through this custom. So if you stay through to the end of the video, you can see that. But without any hesitation, let's get into the customization. I'm gonna do a little bit of a voiceover over some footage that I took while I customized the hat. So what I first started out by doing was printing out some of the bait pattern on my computer and I just ended up practicing the bait shapes and the bait heads and stuff like that because I didn't want to mess up when I actually drew it on the hat because you do want to stencil it in, not stencil it in, but you do want to draw it in on your hat before you just go and paint. So I did end up practicing on this little notepad right here for a little bit. Then I transferred over to precisely drawing the bait pattern on the hat, the brim of the hat, which is what I painted. Yeah, I just took my time and drew the shapes that I think would look good. And if you don't paint exactly those shapes on the hat, it's okay. You can do a little freestyle because the bait pattern looks good random. So there's nothing you really have to copy. You just draw what you want to draw. I then proceeded to just mix up some of the paints. I knew I had to mix a darker green. And then I knew I had to also hit it with some orange and some black to make a dark brown, that bait brown. It took me a few tries, but I eventually mixed it up perfect and I got the colors precisely the way I wanted them. After I had some of my colors mixed up, I just started painting in some of the shapes in the hat. Just random shapes, because I was gonna mix it up, not have too much brown right next to each other, too much green, dark green right next to each other, or light green, you know. Just mix it up, and I set myself up. I did one color at a time. I started with the brown, then the dark green, then the light green, using the same brush, but washing it in between each time. If you're careful with it, you can use a heat gun or a hair dryer carefully to speed up the process of the drying and the painting the coats. The regular amount for me that I used was about two coats per color going over everything twice just to darken it up because some of the white spots showed and I didn't get everything through the first coat because I laid it down kind of light the first time or something. But I did do two coats throughout the brown to the dark green to the light green and yeah, just take your time color in the lines but once again if you do go out of the lines a little bit it's no big deal because you can just paint out a little bit smooth it out and the bape shapes still look great after i was all done with all the painting and everything i took some sneaker protector actually not my normal coating but i took my sneaker protector and sprayed two coats on letting it dry in between each time and yeah sealed it right up well, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys did enjoy and you learned something. You can go do this for yourself. If you did enjoy this amazing video, smash that like button. Smash, smash, smash the like button. Subscribe to this channel and also go check out my other channel, B Terry TV. That is my vlog channel. It'll be linked in the right corner of the screen right now in a card. So if you do want to go check that channel out, make sure you click that card and go subscribe to my vlog channel, B Terry TV. I upload a lot during the week. I upload when I can. I've uploaded 13 videos so far and I've only been working on it a couple weeks. So make sure you go check out B Terry TV. But once again, subscribe to this channel and like this video. If it was helpful, as well, comment down below. This is B Terry Customs with another customization. I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm out. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Huh. Shoot. Sure. I wake up on a daily basis, I count this money up, I'm already